Hello, royal folks. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of royal news and analysis. Before we move on to any further details, I would really love to thank you all for your enormous love and support. And in case you haven't subscribed yet, I mean what are you waiting for guys, hit that subscribe button now. Also please don't forget to press the bell icon. Looks like Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are gearing up for another big move. According to Santa Barbara News Press, via The Express, the Sussexes are considering leaving their Montecito home and relocating to a fancy neighborhood that has a collection of multi-million dollar mansions with miles of horse trails and a private beach. Meanwhile, The Sun reports that the potential move comes as Montecito is experiencing increased property crime. Harry and Meghan first moved to Montecito after a brief stint in Los Angeles, and the relocation was a long time coming for Meghan in particular. At the time, Us Weekly reported that Meghan visited Montecito in her teens and fell in love with the picturesque scenery and stunning architecture. Moving there was always an option, but to begin with, she and Harry wanted to give Los Angeles a shot. Unfortunately, Harry absolutely hated it. The timing was so wrong amid the coronavirus pandemic and they lacked privacy. According to Santa Barbara News Press, Meghan and Harry are considering leaving their nine-bedroom home and relocating to a nearby neighborhood that has a collection of multi-million dollar mansions with miles of horse trails and a private beach. But royal commentators have questioned why the Duke and Duchess are choosing to live in California, known to be a hotspot for celebrities, if privacy and security are areas of concern. Hosts of Us Weekly's Royally Us, Christine Ross and Christina Garibaldi, discuss the Sussex's potential move on this week's episode of their podcast. But Ms. Garibaldi argued that California might not be the place for the couple and suggested they move somewhere a little bit more remote. She said, it seems like they are shopping for a very private estate in Hope Ranch in California and that they have determined that this Montecito mansion does not properly accommodate them. Maybe they want more privacy. Maybe they're looking for something a little bit bigger. Maybe they don't like their neighbors. Ms. Ross raised the Sussex's concerns surrounding security, saying there have been lots of discussions about calls to the police and lots of concerns over their safety and privacy. But that neighborhood is so full of other celebrities that maybe it is really easy for paparazzi to be wandering around and people wandering around hoping to catch a glimpse. They just feel a bit unsafe and kind of fishbowl. I think that this new house that they might be shopping for could be a bit more isolated, not as close to as many big celebrities and just giving them a bit more privacy. Ms. Garibaldi argued, but then maybe move out of California and go a little bit more remote. If you want that ultra-private life, maybe California is not the place for it. Meghan and Harry currently live in the star-studded enclave of Montecito, which is home to the likes of Ellen DeGeneres, Jennifer Aniston, and Oprah Winfrey. The area has recently been a target of burglary specializing in high-value property crime. So what do you think about this news, guys? Do you also think in the end Sussexes will never leave the limelight? Write down in the comments what you think and let me know. Until then, guess we'll just have to wait and see if things turns out to be something after all. Also, if you never want to miss any of my sizzling royal updates like this, subscribe and press the bell icon. As simple as that. Thank you so much.